Check it out. Season. Hey everybody, we are back uh, playing out. Monkey Island 2, LeChuck's more. Revenge. Uh, this is Adventure, I am Check Marty, or Captain Blackheart, or Sighting. however you would like to, whatever you'd like to say. Anyway, um, the out. next thing we have to do is uh, win the uh, trophy for the spinning Valuable contest, prizes. I believe. I don't remember what we use this for, Even a child but I know we definitely it. need it for something. In fact, they do it very well. Oh, you know what? Come on! It's all paid for by Booty Island Parks and Rec. Three-hour tours. See I the think... world. Just put your two I think we can actually go here. here. No. We have to use Are you uh, this or thing. Not? Two, four, six, and then eight. somebody... Uh, the guy with the cannon off screen Ooh, blows the cannon. Like Signals the mail, the mail truck. You come out here. False alarm. I'll give it a try. A volunteer. Oh, we have to do it first. All right, settle down, folks. It changed a lot of this, this from the the, the first like one where you could just literally contender. come through and <laughs> never talk to anyone. Boy. Oh, I hate this. Captain I am, Lugie. of course, Captain Lugi. The Lugster, Lugarama. Hawking the big ones for fame and fortune. Spit away! Yeah. Misfire! Misfire! Everybody run! Gee, that's yeah. too bad, Captain. Let's give him a big hand anyway, folks. At least it's it's kind of complicated. I don't, I don't already remember has the what necessary you equipment. need this for. I just remember you need it. Made in Hong Kong. So you blow the horn. into a prestige-winning skill. He walks off screen. Everybody watches him, and then you move the flags so they're closer. False alarm. As I was saying. Then let his grass wither up and die. I'll come back what here. Was that? Did I hear somebody swallow? What a waste. Use that. Yeah. That. Ugh. Thousands will spit. Hundreds will win. <clears throat> and then you Captain do it again. Boogie is in the house. He didn't say. Get the away. only thing I'm concerned about is he didn't say anything about his spit being all. Let's rude. go. So now, Spit! Come on. we wait until you see. Let her rip! Hey, he's been working out. There Looks like second place. I think that deserves a little applause. Too bad there are only prizes for first place. Yeah. yeah so. Good luck next time. That means we need. Now, how about the rest of you? <coughs> that no means we need. If Blackbeard do. were here, he'd shoot you all right now. All of them. Yeah. Come on, don't be shy. Let it fly. Yeah. Yeah. I know you want to volunteer. It's okay. on the tip of your tongue. Let's try it again. <clears throat> Captain Loogie is in the house. Spit away. Swish, swish. Lock. You can do it. Better not mm. blow it, man. I'm gonna... Once again, ah. looks like second place. That's strange. Oh wait, wait, now, wait, wait. How about the rest of you? You know what? You think I spinning think is gross? Is... I'll tell you yeah. what's gross. Swallowing that stuff is gross. And then we do Prove to me that this. you guys are at least as fun as a pack of llamas. Boy. This stuff makes my spit thick. Yes. I hear there's some That's the line. That's the line that says we are ready. <clears throat> Captain Lugi is in the house. Okay. One more time. Swish swish. Yuck. Chwick. Hey, spitter, 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 and spitter. Hey, two. spitter, spitter, yeah. spitter. Yeah. He's cleared first place. That was truly awe-inspiring. I never noticed this, Sports but this guy has spit just Sheldon all over his hat. Here today. Let me congratulate you know, it's like, you like like right at the edge of his hat. It's just black. spit everywhere. I salute you, That's gross. Captain Lugie. Come on, let's give him a hand. Of course, 
There are plenty more prizes for the rest of you. So how about it? Uh. This may be your last chance at popularity uh. and success. Just look at this juicy God, let's crowd. Get this is disgusting. Okay. Hour tours. Oh, out. I remember now. So you talk to her. Sightseeing. Uh, let's see. I'm, I'm interested, interested in, in chartering a ship. Great. My fee is 6,000 pieces of eight. <coughs> I'll come back later. I'll just come back later. Okay. I'll be here. Cruises. So, what you have to do, you have to take the trophy in here. Walk up here. Inventory. Go down to here and give it to him. How much will you give me for this plaque? I'm not interested. It's worth a mint. It's worth a mint. For a lump of pus on a shingle? Not just any That's lump of pus. That's not just any lump of pus. Oh, yeah? What's so special about it? This is the spit of the person the who killed LeChuck. The person who killed LeChuck is on it. Really? That would make it very valuable. And I do like bronze anyway. I'll give you 6,000 pieces of eight for it. What a coincidence. That's exactly how much we need. All right, let's, uh, we take the 6,000 pieces of eight. We walk out the door. Bum, bum, bum. We go to our inventory and we Great shipwrecks the... of our century. It says here the Mad Monkey sank at 34 North, 85 West. There you go. That is what we need to know. 34 North, 85 West. Sightseeing. And Last we talk to Captain boat. Kate again. I'm interested in chartering a ship. Great. As I mentioned, my fee is 6,000 pieces of eight. Which we have now. Don't you think 6,000 pieces of eight is a bit high? No, I don't. Okay, I'll pay you the 6,000 pieces of eight. <laughs> just immediately you just push over. You yourself a ship. Are you ready to leave now? No, oh, hi. No. Okay. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's blow this popsicle stand. Have you got a course planned or anything? I, I do. I can show you where I want to go on this map that Captain Dredd gave me. Okay, so 34 north, 85 west. This was always kind of a cool thing. Well, here we are. What now? Uh, I will dive in and look for a sunken I'll dive galleon. in and look for the sunken galleon. Are you sure you can swim? Hey, I can hold my breath for ten minutes. Which is true. Uh, there's a scene in the first game where you get thrown underwater, and if you sit there for ten minutes, he will he will still be able to get out, but after ten minutes passes, he dies. Do, do, do. It's very serene. Let's just take a look at what it used to look like. And yes, there's the mad monkey. Perfect. We need the monkey head. And then we can put that in our pocket somehow. Don't ask, it's adventure game logic. And then we can use the anchor. Pull back up. There's I the bonus. the monkey head. Well, let's head back to Booty Island. Well, congratulations on your find, Guybrush. Be sure and tell any friends you might have about capsized charters. See you around the turnpike. See I think if you talk world. to the guy and ask... Um, I'm going to talk to him in here real quick. Because I actually don't know why you need the, the monkey head from the, the sunken monkey or whatever. The mad monkey. How much, How much is, is the map piece? The map piece is made of authentic parchment from the turn of the century. Can't find things like that anymore. Yeah, yeah, but how much is it? Oh, about six million pieces of eight. Uh, I don't think I have that much to spend. Well, well the door's right there, Gabbers. Nice Just grab it and run. Maps for less. No thanks. Do you take credit? Yeah, like you have one. But I do accept personal checks or trade-ins. Good to know. What kind of trade-ins do you accept? I'll take most old swords, some used parrots, 
Almost anything valuable made of bronze, and a few old ship parts. Old ship parts. Would you give me the map piece for any of those things? No, but there's one thing I might trade for the map piece. Uh -huh. There you go. What would you trade for the map piece? There was a certain ship that sunk, and I'd really like the figurehead. There we I'd go. I'd give you the map if you got the figurehead for me. Uh -huh. Can you tell me about the ship with the figurehead? The ship was a huge galleon named the Mad Monkey. Nobody knows where it sank or why, but the figurehead is supposed to be the most fabulous piece of art ever. That's why I want it. I'm a collector of fine art, as I'm sure you can see. What a oh, coincidence. Yeah. I just so happen to have that very figurehead. Well, well, well. I didn't think anyone would ever get the Mad Monkey's figurehead. Can I get the map piece now? Sure. It's yours. Gee, I still can't make heads or tails of it. And I think I need an expert. You do. There we go. Okay. All right. So now we have the fourth map piece. Where do you want to go? Where do we need to go? We need to go to Scab Island. Mm. Let's see one more of these stupid things. What? Gavros got the map piece? Well, How Chuck, dare sir, you let him I get the map news, piece? And I got bad news. The bad news is that Guybrush has found the last piece of the map. Nah, the good news is that I got a plan that can't fail. Ah, you see? He must take the map to a cartographer to have it deciphered. I'll head him off before he gets there. If your plan fails, it will not. Your voodoo lordship. Buh. I mean, those scenes are kind of. Yeah. It's kind of cool to see that that uh, that place before we actually go there in the next part. But it's also kind of like, uh, okay, do we have to watch these? I just want to get back to adventuring. Hello. All right. So now we need to give a piece of the map to Wally, and then we'll automatically give him the rest of it. I've got the rest of it right here. Hmm, very interesting. Can you put it all together into one map for me? I'll do it for you if you'll run an errand for me. Go to the International House of Mojo and ask the fortune teller if my love potion's ready. She's a voodoo okay. lady, not a fortune teller. I'll try to have teller. this done for okay. you when you come back. Ugh, okay. Just running errands. Mostly walking and running errands. That's that's an adventure game for you. Okay, uh, so now we need to go back to the swamp to talk to the voodoo lady, to get the potion, to come back, to get the map. Okay, so use it. And we'll turn it Whoops. Haven't done that. Didn't do that last episode. So, let's see. Back to the swamp. This is kind of where it gets a little tedious. It's like, okay, I've done this like a million times. I'm so sick of doing this. Can we just... Can we just... There we go. Okay. Talk to Voodoo Lady, get the love potion. Back again, Mr. Threepwood. Wally sent me to pick Wally up some love potion. sent me to pick up some love potion. Oh, okay. Tell him I said to enjoy, but to be careful. It's powerful stuff. We get to know. That little guy getting hurt. Wait, I just felt a sudden disturbance in the force. As if a tiny, tiny voice just called out in fear, and then hastily scratched a message in a table. I think Wally's in trouble, and I think LeChuck has something to do with it. Uh-oh. I better go check. Ruh, ruh, raggy. Alrighty. Back to Wally. This would also be nicer if it wasn't so far of a, of a walk. Like, this was a neat idea, but... I don't know, maybe, maybe that's the problem with this game. There's a lot of really neat ideas in it, and it's all executed okay, but a lot some of the ideas just don't work. Like, this this voodoo thing. Just, just have a swamp and let us walk across the swamp. You know, don't put a boat there. Because that just takes up more time. It's it's neat the way it looks, but otherwise it takes up time. Where'd he go? 
Uh oh. Someone's hastily scratched a message here. It just says, LeChuck. Oh no, LeChuck's kidnapped the cartographer. Oh, oh no. Guy. Hey, he has my map. Oh no. Well, we need to go back to the voodoo lady and talk to her. And see what we need to do, how we need to find him, because we don't know where LeChuck is. Alright, so let's go back to the voodoo lady. Because that's the thing, we can't go back to Dread, because Dread only knows how to get to three islands. That's new. To the ghost pirate LeChuck. Care of LeChuck's Island Getaway and Spa. Contents Miscellaneous Voodoo Supplies. Okay. I think there's something moving in well, here. Well, that was easy. Hey, Rich. I sure could use a hand with this one. Uh, looks like another box of live snakes. Sounds like it, too. Well, let's get it on the truck. <laughs> Alright, part three. At long last, we are out of part two. In the Everything else from here is pretty straightforward. There's no bouncing around islands. There's one the part in part four that's a little and ridiculous, nights. but... Guybrush is forced to eat bat lungs and eel bladders to stay alive. Five days he was in a crate. Eventually, Guybrush and the rest of the slithering cargo are delivered to the very doorstep of the Caribbean's most fearsome villain, living or dead, the ghost pirate, LeChuck. Ah, LeChuck's crate of voodoo supplies. You know, we usually don't deliver out this far, and... You guys fucking for a tip? Well, we figured since... Well, you figured wrong. LeChuck don't tip nobody. Gee, what a butt. Here's a tip, don't breathe underwater. Ick, I hate snakes. Snakes. Why'd it have to be snakes? Alright guys, so we are in part three. We are at LeChuck's Fortress. Uh, I'm gonna pause it here. It's a little early, but... I figure I'd go ahead and pause it here and get through the next part uh, all in one go. Because otherwise, it just it's going to take... We're going to have to divide it in the middle, and I don't want to have to do that if we're in the middle of a puzzle. So anyways, uh, until next time, guys, keep adventuring.